Hey guys, it's Jonas95 again. This time we'll look at another Transformer report reviews. This time we'll look at the Transformers Studio Series Deluxe Class Cogman. Yes, Cogman. It's C O G M A N. Cogman. Not Cogman. Cogman. <laughs> As, I'm going to say the word this. So here is Cogman. He is a Deluxe Class. He was from made by Hasbro 2018. Before I look at this here, I'm going to talk about who is Cogman. Cogman was introduced as a character from the Rev Transformers last night. He was a master butler who's working lives with his master, played by Anthony Hoskin, where trying to learn the help between where Mark and where Kate Yeager and the girl, I can't remember his name, the girlfriend, I don't remember his name. To find who is the last night sword at it was location. What well, later on entirely until at the end of the film, or after his master has been killed by Megatron, he was a caught him in a blast of smithereens. Well, Kongman he survived, he was checking on the master, he's dying on arms, his blast breath up before he was they try to stop him with this. This was the last time we was seeing him. And that was it. He was never seen again because we're never going to see whatever happened to him. Well, that's my big theory. It was originally planned to see well, but it got cancelled because of poor box office. And speaking of which, let's take a look at the figure itself. I'm very excited to get this one. This is the first time we got him. Back in 2017, Cogman was originally supposed to be hit the store shelf. He was originally supposed to make the figure, supposed to hit the store shelf, supposed to come out. But then the film came out, it bombed the box office. But also, this figure just never happened. It just canceled. The line was canceled due to the poor box office. But after two years and deck following the two years, Hasbro decided to go back. Hasbro decided to go back to bring this this guy up here until it finally appears. So here he is. Kind of is the first time in line. Before I already took down the box, let's take a look here. Nice little artwork from. Image of Cogman. This is figure number 39. It's from Transform Last Night. It comes with Splay Sand. Was this just like all the figures? Comes with Splay Sand. Looks nice like detail arts. The other side is the same. Shows a little full art ones. And on the back, there is no re. It's a little bio in this. I'm going to pause to read. The re says. While speeding through the street of London, Cogman remembers of Sir Edmund Burton. There you go. Sir Edmund. Sir Edmund Burton. That's right. His name is Sir Edmund Burton. Edmund Burton. That's right. That's his name. Sir Edmund Burton is that Asia called Snuggle. Uh, sorry to pronounce it. There we go. He was a working from his, his master, Sir Edmund Burton, who was played by Eddie Hosker. Now this vehicle mode is based on Aston Martin. This vehicle mode is based on Aston Martin. It says Land and Skate that was trying to recreate a scene where where Mark and his other they try to manage to escape from the lens. If you had not seen the movie. It says 19 step. Shows other figures of Bell. There's scrap metal, which I got here. Shatter, unfortunately I don't have it. Now, I've seen the Bolt Matrix review from this herd. They said this figure was crap. It is the worst Transformer figure I've ever seen. But I will get the hands on the Shatter. So that's about the package. Let's take a look at the figure itself. So here is Cogman out of the box. Now, vehicle mode. He is based on the Anston Martin, which is. Which is a car looks kind of like one. It's just a little silver. I like has eyes of LED lights. It's got a little front heat grills. So there's a little transverse plastic windows. And there's a detail in the back here. Nothing I see. And down here it's got a robot junks. <coughs> Very cool is looking field mode. It's got a little world. Now for surgery he comes with a I'm trying to get trying to get 
He comes with swords removed. Comes with a sword. This looks nice. It's just a black and silver plastic. Doesn't it? it's just a hard plastic. Nice little details. It goes on plug into his peg over his holes. And pegs and hold this. One of his coolest surgery, he opens he opens up, you can see there's a driver. It's got a little driver, it was just like he did the movie. He take it inside. So here is Cogman. Now he is the headmasters. Which is pretty funny. He looks he tells. Now nice little small details. Now in the movie he does not have vehicle modes, just a robot mode. He's he's a little smaller size of the human size. It's got a little articulation, it's got a little head to rotate. And his arms goes up and down and his legs towards the neck and has been in need so that's pretty much it. Now he is very similar to the uh Nitro Suits the Headmaster as you remember I did with my review a long time ago. Now for transfer to his head you turn his head turn you can see there's a head mode. Speaking of head mode Let's take in, let's dive and take a look at the robot mode. First, I said already, oh, door, and so, let me snap the keys. Now, first to do, let's open his chest piece, and let's go a little peg hole. Let's go snap the piece, then open the door, and oh, let's go until it's pop. Gonna start rotating. Then rotate his teeth. Also, let's pull his teeth. Let's start unconnect. Let's, let's unpack. You can see there's. Oh, forgot his hand. Let's start rotate his hand. Start closing. Do what it's actually saying. Hold his hand. And unpack. So here it is. Here is the Cogman's robot. Mode. Oh wait, where's the head? This head goes connect to his. So here is Cogman in his robot mode. Yeah, he looks pretty nice looking. He's pretty looks movie accurate. Not much. Let's go back. Let's go. Shell form is the back. Now he's about five inch half. For size comparison, here's next to the Bumblebees from the Bumblebee movie. And speaking of Bumblebee, I forgot to mention there was upcoming the the studio series, the next wave. They're doing Bumblebees, the Volkswagen called the War the World War Two. Oh no, not World War Two, the Jeep Bumblebee. What's I'm very excited. The Army Chief, I'm very excited. Hands on. Now, if you've seen the movie, if you've seen the movie Transfer last night, he's a little bit size of human size. Speaking of human size, here is next to Finn. Yeah, Finn. Now for that, let's take a look at the head sculpt. I think they did a good job how he looks like dead capture in the movie. I like his head. It looks pretty nice looking details. I like his eyes blue. No LED lights, unfortunately. There's no light piping. I like his detail silver with details. Sparkly. 
I like it has detail on the stomach. It kind of reminds me of Freepio. See Freepio. Nice little detail. Problem is his arms is kind of loose. His arms feel loose. Nice little detail. His foot. Shows the back and the details. Now for weapons, the circuit I said early. It goes hold to his sword. Now, articulation for the Cogman, it does have heads on King Rotate left. We see some grease. It does go up and down. Not much because it's hated by his gimmick. It does go side to side. His arms goes up and down. goes in and out that much. It's got hinge joints around. He has a thigh swivel. He has a bicep swivel. He has a bend in the elbow. And oh. oh okay, sorry about that. Sadly there's no race articulation because hidden transformations. And fortunately there's there's no waist articulation. That's kinda unfortunately. It's like it's forwards and back goes in and out that much. It has it has a thigh swivel. He has a bend in the knee. And this thing goes forwards and back. So that's about. So there you have it. So that's about the uh, deluxe class. So that is a deluxe class to you, Series Cognomen. I'm very happy and finally glad we got the Cognomen here. This is the first time. We never got him for our last two years until now. He's finally here. So I'm pretty excited to get this one. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this one. What do you guys your thought? Let us know in the comment below. Be sure don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. So thanks for watching and goodbye.